Check, check, hello, can you read me? Buck Thunder, Buck, Buck, oh, it's me, Bill, your divorce attorney. Welcome to Buck Thunder 2, Xeno Slaughter. Another Buck Thunder game. Your ex-wife is back and more evil than ever. She's sending a bunch of her new blood-sucking boyfriends out. So go sh Shoot him, just kill him all, Buck. That's that's the game. Buck, it's me, Phil, your divorce lawyer again. You remember how to move and jump and everything, right? There's shit on the screen that tells you how to do all that stuff. I mean, come on, Buck. This is the second game. You know how to do all this shit. All right, Buck, you're gonna have to use the brand new double jump to get over there. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Buck. I forgot there's no double jump. Just crouch. We gotta try crouching, Buck. Fucking scheduling and scoping bullshit. A fucking crouch prioritized over a double jump. Who is this? Who, who, who are these people above us? Stay sharp, Buck. A bunch of your ex-wife's new alien boyfriends. There they are, coming right at you. Just shoot them, Buck. You remember how to shoot, don't you? That's what I'm talking about, Buck. Kill those fuckers. You're the man. I love you, Buck. You're so fucking cool. Oh, I'm so excited and lit up to be your divorce attorney. You have no idea you're my favorite client. All right, Buck, just open. Oh my god, Buck, you did it. You opened the door. You're a fucking genius. You are my favorite client. It's me, by the way, your divorce attorney. Don't forget, I'm Phil, your divorce attorney. Let's go. Let's get moving. Let's defeat your ex-wife. Your divorce attorney. Let me fill you in on what's going on. An alien spaceship landed in your ex-wife's backyard. She fell in love with the leader, and it turns out they're all a hive mind, so she's fucking all of them. What are the odds? I know that's probably what you're thinking, but just get out there and kill them, Buck. It's all you can do. Over and out. say goodbye to mom and dad before they left for their trip. You know they were pissed, right? Whatever, we got the place to ourselves now. Oh my God, don't give me that look, narc. What are you mad that I'm throwing this party tonight? <laughs> it's fine. Mom and dad are gone for a whole fucking week. We can do whatever we want. Here, come on, try some. <laughs> you know it's good for your depression, right? Okay. Whoa, 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 it's kicking in. Uh, what is wrong with your face? Um, as I was saying, okay, we're totally gonna rage tonight. I cannot wait. I gotta text Jen and make sure she brings the good shit. Uh, did you know she almost got a DUI? Don't tell anyone. That is a secret, but everyone already knows. <laughs> it's really fucked up. Her parents took away her car, which sucks because we could fit two kegs in her trunk. I and mean, whatever, I think Oliver's boyfriend has it covered, which, by the way, oh, finally, there you are. I felt like I was losing my mind. So, do you want any or nah? Fine, more for me then. All right, I'm gonna go get ready for the party. This stuff's gonna last me all week. It is powerful. Mom told me I was in charge. She did it in secret so it wouldn't hurt your feelings and Dad said that he flat out doesn't love you. It was actually pretty messed up. By the way, Mom left you a note on the fridge. Go read it. Then come meet me outside. I need your help grabbing party shit from the store.
So, I guess... Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? Get down and stay quiet. I knew aliens were real. Son, I want a ha. She tell hit that one. Hello, what? One, one. You understand what they're saying? Oh shit! Look, it's Mr. Pilfrey. He's got that um, what's it called? Uh, dementia. Oh, what's going on out here, Martha? Is that you? Oh my god! Oh my god! What did they just do to Mr. Pilfrey? <laughs> Hola, mi mato. It's a What the fuck is going on? Cho, machiza, wana ho. No man de tanda, ula ba kiwa la kanga ma. Oh, da re, ya. So, no ma tai ta lu si. Hasta ta ba wa. Isa, wo ke ka wa. Wan. Finally! Oh my god, finally I'm free, thank god! What a nightmare! Listen, can you pull the inhibitor chip out of me? It's the metal thing stuck in me, just pull it out! What the fuck is that? Oh, that feels so much better. Thank you. Yeah, sorry about the spit. I I, I needed to get you infected with the translator microbes. That, that, that's sort of how it works. I guess you guys don't have those here yet. Listen, my name's Kenny. I'm a Gatlian. Uh, we we gotta kind of we gotta move. Oh, what is it? Is it talking to you? Maybe we should go back to the Ignore house. Ignore her. It's very important that you listen to everything I say. Okay, it is your lucky day right now. We can survive this together if you just listen to me. Those G3 guys are going to turn your whole species into drugs. Can you handle a gun? Because, you know, I'm kind of a gun, and if you don't use me to kill those G3... Fuck yeah, there we go. Uh, you go All right, first kill. I am so glad you picked me up. But let's keep going. Not bad, alien. Not bad at all. Let's head to that base. Well, here you go. It's a G3 warp base. Okay, let's just clean house and warp out of here. Do you really not know what button to press? You just keep hitting buttons. Triggers. All of them. You, one of them's gonna make me shoot. Oh, shit, it's a merc. They're tougher. Try pressing anything. Go nuts, mash them all. Is this your first fucking game? Fuck yeah! Now grab the warp truck and use this to warp the hell off this doomed planet! Sorry, no offense. I don't mean to upset you, but yes, your planet is doomed right now. Okay, listen, don't worry about the beeping. The beeping's fine. It's just, it's gonna blow up soon. We just need to plug this thing into power. Do, do you have something back at your house? That, you know, if you live in one of these huts around here, take us there, because we gotta move. We gotta move, move, move. Listen, bring me up close to your face. Come on, just run. Look down the sights and fire. You're doing great, by the way. Do you really not know what button to press? You just keep... Oh, I'm proud of you. Try pressing anything. Go nuts, mash them all. Is this your first fucking game? That's your hut, right? The one that the weird alien you were with ran off to? We're almost there. Come on, just press something. It's definitely not that hard to figure out. I'm a gun! Shoot me! Oh, thank God you're still alive! I just killed an alien! Look, I got blood in my mouth! I think we're all gonna die! You got anything in here that emits, I don't know, microwaves? I know it's a lot to ask. What, like a fucking microwave? Oh, whoa. Translator microbes, they're contagious, but can please just move past all this shit? So... Oh, thank God, it works. It's just gonna need a second to boot up. Hello, aliens of Earth. My name is Gumnatrous, leader of the G3 cartel. Don't resist. Any attempts to fight us will be futile. You are now officially the property of the G3 cartel. Alright, it's go time. Let's get out of here. Wait. Get out of here. Where are we going? To find somebody who can help. You ever been to the 
big city because you're about to, except that it's a space city. It's a huge space city and you're going to be out of your element. And you better just follow my lead. What? What just happened? Looks like we made it. Welcome to Blim City. Did you just warp our entire house to another planet? Yeah, keep up. We'll be safe here. Now take me outside. What? You're going out there into space? Yeah, welcome to fucking space! So, this is Blim City. Not not bad, huh? I don't know how we're gonna find Gene, though. Let's just ask around. There's all kinds of aliens out here. Let's just, let's just ask. He, he is famous. We can't open those yet. We're, we're gonna need something sharp. Uh, hello? Get away. They'll take my shit. Oh my god. It, it can't be. What do you want? You're not the famous bounty hunter Gene Zaruthian, are you? Who's asking? You're you're really Gene. Yeah, I'm really Gene. That's me. Like on the ads. Disappointed? Guess how I feel. Uh, okay, well, whoopsies. Huh. We were gonna ask for your help fighting the G3 cartel, but... Kid, do I look like I can help anyone? I just got evicted. I don't even have a goddamn home. Can, can you point us in the direction of, you know, a, a, a bounty hunter friend that's still working, you know, still has their legs? Ho, 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 ho. Look at that nice house. God damn. Where'd that come from? That's a great fucking house. You see that house? Huh? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, th that's this hairy alien's house, the one holding me. Ah, damn. Can't stop looking at that beautiful house. Uh, okay. The gears are turning. Maybe I can help you. You can? Uh, but you just said... Maybe the... Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I, I said I'd help you fight the... Who, who'd you say? The, the G3 cartel? Oh, yeah. Oh, come on, that's crazy, but... Okay, well, whatever, whatever. Yeah, 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 sure. We'll, we'll kill them all. Easy. <laughs> I've got a fully operational bounty suit in my cart over there. Really? Well, that's, that's convenient. Yeah, I can turn that hairy kid of yours into a true blue bounty hunter. But if they die... I want the house. That's the trade. Are you sure? I, I don't think they've even fired a gun before today. And, and wait, wait you, you want the house in return? Yeah. This is a great deal for you. I mean, you get all my old bounty hunter shit and I might get a house. Uh, I don't know. Enough talking. J just be a gun for a second. You, hairy kid, put on the suit. See how you feel. Then make a decision, yeah? I can always just pawn this shit off. Okay, g go ahead. Try it on. What choice do we have? You look great, kid. A natural. Definitely not gonna die on your first bounty. All right, I guess we'll give it a shot, but I, I don't know about this. Ah, oh, yeah, shit. It's still in trial mode. I pawned off the activation license. The ticket should be in one of your pockets. Some loose change, too. Should be enough. Take that down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop, and he'll get you all set up. The suit will help you get there. Hey there, Gene Zaruthian. It's me, Sudo, your helpful bounty hunting assistant. Before I enable mobility, I just need to make sure your info scanner is online. Can you go ahead and give the area a quick scan for me? Okay, perfect. Great job. I've identified your current objective. Head on down to Mr. Keep's pawn shop. Can you see the waypoint? Perfectamundo. Everything is in working order. Mobility unlocked. You are free to move, Gene. All right. I'll get things set up at your house while you're gone. Uh, okay, let's Ooh, just... Oops, sorry about all those pop-ups. I forgot to warn you about that. Um, you can close them with the interact button, but they are going to keep coming back non-stop. Uh, that's just going to keep happening until you activate the license. Sorry, you better hurry up. You, you able to see okay? Sorry, I, I didn't expect Gene to be like that. What's up, freak? Jorb, greet the customer properly. Welcome to Mr. Keep's dipshit. We're your friendly neighborhood pie shop. Buy something or don't, nobody even cares. Jorb! Oh, so old Zaruthian doesn't feel like pawning his license key anymore. What? Did he win the sweepstakes? Ha! Okay, so you want this license key. But 
but it's really nice. I kind of want it for myself. You've got enough useless shit, Dad. Fine, take it. It's yours. Okay, fuck yeah. Activation license accepted. Bounty hunting suit is in perfect working order. Time for an important question. Would you like to keep me on as your permanent in-suit advisor? That was the best choice you could have made. All right, bye-bye now. I'll be back a bunch. Whoa, not bad. It's got your vital readings, armor levels, even my biometrics. Gene really came through, didn't he? I told you he'd be great. Perfect. Just what this galaxy needs. Another good-for-nothing bounty hunter. Out of my star! All right, bounty hunter. I guess let's head back to the house and check in with Gene. You'll find it. You'll figure it out. Hey, you can run, you know. You, you, I don't know if you do that. Try hitting the button on your screen. I, I can't say the name of the button, because I have no fucking clue what kind of controller or keyboard you're using. Huh, there's there's little guys coming out of your house. That, okay. Hey! Nice house you got here. Real ritzy. Way better than my bench. Oh, wow, you really made yourself at home, huh? Oh, there you are. Who's this weirdo, and why is he setting up a fucking huge alien computer in our living room? Okay. First of all, that alien computer is a very expensive and surprisingly operational Bounty 5000. So, uh, you're welcome. A what 5000? The kid here thinks they're gonna be a big bad bounty hunter. I set them up with some fancy equipment, so they're letting me have the house when they die. Kid? They're not my kid. I'm their sister. How old do you think I am? Listen, hairball, I don't know what kind of alien you are or how fast you age. I'm just making my best guesses here. You were only gone five minutes, and you already told some random alien he could move in with us. That's what you did. Look, I know it's a lot all at once, but we need him to save your species, so do you think you could put up with him for a bit? Well, yeah, if it's gonna help, sure. I'm sorry, everything I've ever known just got flipped upside down, so I don't know what's weird or not anymore. I... I don't like getting up to take shit, so I'm just gonna shit right here in the couch later. I don't have to shit right now, but just a heads up. Like that. Was that weird or was that normal? It was weird, right? It was weird. Your mom's nice. Anyway, come talk to me when you're ready to get down to business. So what? We just jump into the deep end and start hunting down G3 officers or, or what? I'm not sure you're ready just yet. I mean, they don't let you fuck the glumpers at glumpies without a level 4 fuck pass, do they? What? I, I, I don't know. Well, they don't. Maybe I should send you out on a little test run first, eh? Uh, okay, sure. I've got just the thing. A small-time local gangster by the name of Nine Torg. She took my favorite knife. She's got an operation out in the slums. Maybe you kill her and get my knife back. <laughs> then we'll talk. Maybe take you out to Glumpy's to celebrate. All right, so we, we just head out to the slums? No, moron. You gotta use the Bounty 5000 to initiate a bounty. That's what I went through all the trouble of setting it up for. Okay, Jesus. Shit. Normally that door would open up a gateway to let you walk right through it. So what do we do? Calm down. The bounty's right here in Glim. You mind just heading out on foot? The slums gateway ain't too far from here. I'll get the Bounty 5000 all fixed up while you're gone. Yeah, sure. All right, let's go, Bounty Hunter. Uh, so bounty hunting, huh? Are you really going to kill people? Actually, we, we've killed a couple people already, you know? And so did you? So soon we forget? Fine, I guess I'll just hang around at home and wait for you to do all your little murders. Are you mad at us or jealous? Uh, jealous? I want to kill evil aliens, too. What are you, go ahead, don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Maybe I'll go see what the drinking age is here in space. Don't forget to get my knife! We're looking for the gateway to the slums, I guess. Look, it shouldn't be too far. L listen, just follow the waypoint. That's why you're wearing that fancy suit, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's got the augmented reality thing on it, right? Hello, citizens. I'm Blim City Magistrate Clug Nugman, and I have heard your concern. Murder rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly... Hey! 
Don't even think. Hey, uh, Kit, uh, excuse me, can we get our, uh, we need to make our way into the slums, please? No. Hold on. So you really want to get into the slums, huh? Then settle the bet for oh, us. Come on, come on. Don't, 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 don't make him answer this no, one. No, I want to know. It's fine. We'll, we'll help. Okay, great. If you saw us at the bar, which of us would you ask out? I guess the red guy. Whoa, seriously? Okay, come on. You, you don't gotta say that just to make him feel better. He's a big boy. He can take it if you think he's way uglier than that. No, no, no. They said me. They picked me, dude. They picked me, not you. They picked me. They said I was hotter, not you. <laughs> well, it's true. Look at you. I'm not a liar, man. I never lied in my life. I look at you and I see Bill. No, well, well, that's not what they said. They said I. They picked me. I. They said I was hotter. I. Did you say that? Listen, we're not switching around here. We picked the red guy. That's the direction we're moving in. Thank you. Thank God. Thank you so much for that changing. I really thought you were going to flake on me. Nah. Thank you. No, nah, fuck you. Change your mind right now. Pick me instead. This is insane. I am so much hot. You, you need to chill out. All right, they picked me, and that's final. That's a final pick. If you want to throw a fit, do it on your own time. Just let me have this one time, man. Hey, thanks for being honest. Look, don't tell anyone, but you can go through my door anytime you want from now on. Our right, little secret. Free passage in and out of the slums. Wow, thank you. you. You have no idea how helpful that is. Well, my door's locked forever. You made an enemy today. You're never, ever gonna get to use my door. Well, you know what? That's fine, because we have this other door. I think we handled that as best we could. You... I've never been topside. Oh, Lord. Oh, it's a topsider. Not interested. Hey, oh my god, I broke my fucking leg coming down that pipe. Be careful. Sorry to hear that. Well, well, <laughs> look what we got here. Fresh meat. Hey there, fresh meat. Welcome to the slums, fresh meat. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Fucking kid. What's wrong, fresh meat? You scared of a little kid? <laughs> yeah, I'm a little kid. Look at me. Look at me. <laughs> You're scared of me? Oh, I'm scary. Not. <laughs> well, maybe I am. <laughs> Look at me, I'm scary. No, we just want to get past. Attention, Blim City citizen. You are wearing an unregistered bounty. Shit, shirt. we gotta Prepare take down these drones. Oh, shit, fresh meat. Bounty hunting is a Oh, am I supposed to be impressed? You shot all the drones? must have met my son. He calls everyone fresh meat. Thanks for not shooting him. Things have been really hard since his annoying dad got shot and killed. It's been hard because even though my annoying husband is gone, my son is still so annoying too. So go ahead and kill him if you really want to. I'm not gonna stop you. I'd love to not have any annoying family members left. We're gonna get to Nine Torque. You have to get through all our trusty foot soldiers first. Hey, what are you doing? What the fuck? Holy shit, you just killed Jason! Jason's dead! Oh shit, here we go. We're gonna have to kill some of these Torque foot soldiers to prove ourselves around here. These people think we're weak. Not on my watch. What are you, some kind of bounty hunter? The slums are full, asshole. Yeah, this is Nine Torque's turf. The coolest turf. Shit, they're shooting at us. Come shoot back. Come on, shoot back. It's gonna be so easy to kill you. Nine Torg trained us real good. We're the toughest enemies in the game, I think. You've been squished. More G3. Okay, maybe you're stronger than oh, the dog. This, this is bad. You fucking don't even know. There's a lot of them. Hey, well, don't shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. Wow, all right. We got them all. Usually these Torgs aren't so hostile. Something must be going on. Let's look around for somebody who can help us. I'm so lonely over here. I got all this great information I could share. Hello there, friend. Can I help you? Is 
So, uh, how do you like living down here in the slums? It's sort of colorful down here, at least. What? Are you serious? This is one of the worst places anyone can live. You can't see that just by looking at it? It's more sludge than anything else, and the sludge is toxic. Oof, sorry. Yeah, that sludge does look pretty awful. No, the sludge is the best part. It's the quickest way out. Just hop in there and you got a one-way ticket out of here. Imagine if we didn't have the sludge. Then we'd really be trapped. Anyway, yeah, living here is bad. So, uh, what exactly are you doing out here? What? I'm fishing. You can tell I'm fishing, right? Oh, right. Duh, of course. Of course. Sorry. That, it's, it's very obvious. Yes. So, ha have you caught anything? No. Never have, never will. No fish can live down here in this sludge. If there aren't any fish in there, why are you fishing? What's, what is that? What's going on? Because I'm still working up the courage to drown myself. Yikes. Wow. Okay. TMI, maybe, a little bit. Uh, you're a wise old fisherman. Can you tell us a little bit about Nine Tor? Quiet. She's got ears everywhere. Or antennae. Whatever ants here with. Is she really that dangerous? Come on. I mean, she's just one gang lord. Just one? Pfft. What about the other eight Torgs? Wait, so the Nine and Nine Torg is... It's a counter? There's Nine Torgs? Nine clones, yep. And that's just what's left. There used to be even more of them, but they always kill each other. Fighting for dominance over what? This hellhole? <laughs> This month, nine Torgs in charge. Last month, it was 14 Torg before they killed her. Now, nine Torgs fighting with five Torg. It never ends. Which one do you prefer? Oh, eight Torg is the hottest. Do you know how we can get to nine Torg? Buddy, all I know is fish, and I barely know fish. But let's just pretend there's a laundromat you can sneak through to get to Sludge Works over there. Are we pretending, or is there really a laundromat? Come on, kid, take the hint. Either we're pretending, or Nine Torg's goons kill me for squealing. Okay, I got it. We're pretending. Oh, Christ, just follow that path along the sludge. Hey, thanks for the info, uh, wise fisherman. We'll see you later. Have a good day now. Oh, hey, you want to see a cool party trick I used to do? Aim me at those platforms. <laughs> Fuck yeah, I told you. Did you see how fun that was? I call it my glob shot. It comes out of my trick hole. All Gatlians have a different kind of trick hole. My mine does this. Boy, you are learning a lot today, aren't you? Yeah, we can't get inside that lug locks without something really sharp. Yes! Oh, oh my god, I can do this all day. Those, those are the fucking rule? God, I love spewing big gloopy globs. Hey, what the fuck? Did he just kill everyone? Hold up, don't shoot. I, I got an idea. It's another trick up my little slimy sleeve. Try hitting him with my glob shot. Take your time and aim. Whoa, perfect shot! You fucking nailed it! How sick was that? Whew, okay. I gotta recharge. It doesn't take too long, but it's a little longer when there's enemies nearby, you know? My, my, my body gets too tense. It's, it's like trying to piss when someone's watching, you know? They're gonna be here any minute. Just, just patient. Oi, fuck you! I'm sick of this! I wanna tear through someone's guts! Oh, I think they're talking about Gene's knife. Ah, fuck you! Got it, freak. We've had enough of your bullshit, yeah. huh? Who's there? 
Who are you? Uh, hey! Hello there, friends! Oh, I, I think it's the buyer. Hey, are you the buyer? Uh, yeah, we're here to, uh, buy, buy a knife? You guys are selling a knife, yeah? Oh, perfect. You're really late. We were starting to get worried. Just go with it. No shooting. All right, here's the product. A genuine talking knife. I gotta be honest with you, he's a real piece of shit. He's extremely violent. He basically only talks about wanting to kill people in very disturbing ways. Fuck you, I'm gonna carve out your anal cavity. Gonna make it three times as big. Your shit's just gonna drop right out of there. Let's see what I'm talking about? Oh, a perfect. Oh. Fuck yes, thank you! Pleased to meet you, I'm Knifey! Now use me, use me! Let me fucking... Oh, fuck yes, finally! You have no idea how long oh I've been God. thinking about you this! You killed the love of my life! Let me in there! Yes, fuck yes! More, more, I need more stabbing! Hey you, listen, point me at your raw fleshy little tummy and jab me right into there! Let's get all those guts torn up! Let's see that fucking red goop spill out! I can't stop now! Oh, uh, that's a pass for us! Is this really the knife Gene was talking about? Gene? Did you just say Gene? Okay, change of plans. Bring me to Gene, so I can fucking decapitate him! Wait, what? Why? He sent us to rescue you! Oh, that's rich. There's no way I'm forgiving him, though, for leaving me with that fucking Nine Torg. He's dead to me! Huh? You know Nine Torg? We're trying to kill her! Oh, perfect! Finally, we're on the same page! Let's kill Nine Torg, then Gene! Okay, definitely Nine Torg, but l l let's put a pin in the, the whole Gene thing. H how do we get out of here? With my tether ability! I'm more than just a knife, you racist! I can tether too! Look up and latch on! Yeah, there we go! <laughs> Fucking cool, right? You gotta use me to swing across this sludge! Oh, fuck yeah! Not as good as stabbing, but still pretty good. Well, all right. Where, where to next? The Sludge Works processing plant. Nine Torg was talking about some traitor she had to deal with. Probably another one of her clones. Five Torg or six Torg or whatever. I don't know. There's too many now. There's too many Torgs. How many clones are there? Who the fuck cares? Stop thinking so hard and just look for the big Sludge Works sign. I want to stab somebody. Locks. Use me! I can open those fuckers up real good! And there's loot inside for you too! Win-win! Yes! So you, uh, mentioned that Gene gave you to Nine Torg? Gave? Try to put me away in a game of space poker! That sack of shit! I can't wait to stab all three of his fucking eyes! Even the wonky one! Especially the wonky one! Hate that one! Oh, they look stabbable. Use me on them. I want blood. Oh, yes. Oh, do this every time. Never fire your Gatlian again. Please, just use me for killing now. Making a knife for your only any percent run. Oh, hey, there's some Gatorol. That, 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 that'll fill me. Oh, thank Jesus. Okay. That. Oh, mommy, uh, that's the stuff. Sludge works. Nine Torch should be here. Who's at the right man? The legendary ant killer approaches, and they obtain the fearsome knife of death. Oh, brother! Oh, my ant brethren, fight for your lives and avenge our fallen. Look, I'm just saying, my glove shot might be helpful. You know. Disgusting with the glob. Exterminated! Hey. Oh, what do we have here? 
Let's glob it to him. The ant killer is soaked in the fluid of our vision, but they shed scares. Protect my doors at all costs. Ah, let's ride this way. Come on, kill. Kill, yes, yes, kill, kill, murder. We're all gonna die. Not sure why, we're still fighting, but let's just keep going until we all get killed, because why not? I guess, who? okay, I'm not sure what came over me there. I think I got caught up in the moment or something, but hey, good work, team. Let's go get Nine Torque. Any last words, Five Torg? Is that Nine Torg talking? Fuck off! I've always said you were the worst Torg! You know, Seven Torg said the same thing. Right before I killed her. Damn you! And you're next. You got this! How do you feel, Bounty Hunter? I, I feel pretty good. I, I, I really didn't know if we'd be able to pull it off. All right, it's time. Time for what? Time to carve out a piece of it. I'm thinking we go with a full slab of thigh meat, but since it's your first, I'll let you pick. Jesus, oh God, I can't look. I can't, I can't. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Hell, she's a gusher. Could we have just taken like a fingernail, some spit, uh, maybe a blood sample? Yeah, sure, could have, I guess. Hey, I'm Five Torg. Thank you for killing my evil clone. I don't mind if you mutilate her corpse, really. It's fine. You did such a good job. That was like off the hook. You're not gonna take over and end up being just as evil as Nine Torg, right? Oh, uh -huh. don't worry. Things are gonna be a lot. Well, hey, hey, what are you doing? Ah, ah, I can't feel that, you know. Ah, fuck! Cut it out! You don't want three Torg in charge. Trust me, there's still a literal child. 
Nice, we killed another boss. I, I, I think like a, a bonus secret boss. Good work. Turn in our first bounty. Hey, you know, that was some pretty solid bounty hunting back there. I mean, I mean don't don't get too cocky about it or anything, but it was pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. That was some good killing. And I'm somewhat of a killing expert, actually. I can't wait to see Gene's face when he sees we pulled this off. Let's head back up through the slums tunnel. Hey, you thought you beat all the torques, huh? Oh, no, no. I don't know why that guy even bothered attacking us. I almost feel bad. Feel free to keep exploring, but whenever you're ready, we just got to go through the tunnel that we came here in. You know, that tunnel? Gagging. Take me to Gene and let's stab him in the gut. Christopher Walken? Hey, I'm walking here. This is New York City. Yeah, pretty good, right? Ah, oh, the translator, Mike Chris. Well, we're thinking about two different people, but same kind of thing, same kind of idea. No blood? Oh, what a fucking ripoff.
What's inside? I don't care, I just want to stab it. I know these aren't the best circumstances, hey. but you know, it's actually kind of cool getting Come to be a- on! There's a good treasure over here! I'm not lying to you. I'm just trying to help you find some treasure. Oh, you're not interested in some shiny? There we go. You found the treasure. It wasn't very hard to find, was it? Aren't you glad you listened to me? What's in there? What did you get? Actually, wait, don't tell me. I don't want to be disappointed. I just hope you enjoy it. Muscle bounty hunter, Jesus!
Boy, you are always in some kind of rush, aren't you? I'm not judging. I'm just, just, just observing. Yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. Ow, I know this is hurting you too, so get the fuck out of this shit! Okay, yeah, my leg's still very broken. There's 
something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. Yeah, we got, we got them out of the yeah. lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Klug Nugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Blim City Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Fergals and Space Meth out of the hands of our extremely horny geriatrics. No criminal organizations like the G3 cartel have been able to sow their evil seeds in our fair city. For now, remember, we're all... What's in here? Hey, sorry, yeah, no, he can't talk. He just sort of makes that noise. Huh, that's, uh, that's unfortunate for him. Magistrate Clug Nugman and I have heard your concerns. Murder rates are on the rise. The city's water supply has clearly been poisoned again by Gary the Poisoner. And the mandatory sexual repression chips that we put in our elderly citizens have once again backfired, this time making them far, far horrible than ever. However, there's something plaguing our city far worse than any of those issues. Cold, hard drugs. These figures don't lie. However, things don't have to be this way. As Chancellor, under my five-year plan, all drugs will be eradicated. And that's the Clug Nugman promise. Thanks to our new Keep Flip Clean initiative, we've managed to keep drugs like Fergals and Space Meth out of the hands of our extremely horny geriatrics. No criminal organization. Remember, we're all in this together. No matter how many surveillance drones we purchase. Are you tired of your re Are you tired of your regular taking your pills situation where you have to put all your pills in like a first day through last day kind of container? Well, now there's a new solution. This company that I'm Are you tired of your regular taking your pills? situation where you have to huh why is the door closed like uh first day through last day kind of what is it well, now you got my munch dash delivery what no it's us oh shit really good job oh, hold on is that jane okay get ready i want you to stab me right into his fat little belly i don't know if i can say that oh it's for sale for one thousand 
I'll buy it right now. What the hell, Gene? He installed new locks because he assumed you'd get killed. He keeps saying it's his house now. What? No. I just took the liberty of upgrading your security. Did you really kill Nine Talk, though? Yeah, we actually did. Well, well, well. Didn't think you had it in you. I'm really blown away. I'll be honest with you. I expected you to die. Oh, thank you. So, what did it feel like? Killing nine tog. Look, I gotta be honest, it felt good. It felt great. I mean... Hey, Gene, lift up that shirt and expose your soft little belly for me. I'm coming in hot. Yes. Forgot how psycho he was. Why don't you just, uh, hold on to him for now? Oh, sure, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep him far away from you. Yeah, thanks. Now, uh, go turn in your bounty at the Bounty 5000. I got it all set up for you. No, seriously, let me stab him. Well, there you go. You're a real bounty hunter now. Huh, would you look at that? I, I guess we're really doing it. Yeah, I didn't expect you to get your footing so quick. I don't even have any leads on any G3 bounties. You ever, uh, serious about going after them, huh? You bet. Well, we'll take them all down, including Garmantuous. Well, you're welcome to try, and if you do, you might want to go to the pawn shop and buy back the Dodge unit I pawned off. Forgot to tell you about it. Go scrounge up some pesos and buy that, or whatever else tickles your fancy. I'll have some G3 bounties ready for you by the time you get back. Sure, sounds good. Thanks, Gene. Just maybe next time don't assume we're just gonna die. Right. Got it. Hello, and welcome to Human TV, your number one choice for the scariest... What, while you were off murdering a gang lord in the slums? How is it down there? Any cool shops, or is it just sort of depressing? Everyone up here just makes the slums sound really depressing. I'm probably just gonna not go down there, to be honest. But it is pretty crazy you killed a gang lord. And she was a woman, though. Not very feminist of you to kill a woman in power. Oh, man. You're really gonna need that Dodge unit from the pawn shop. The suit's not really complete without it. Look, I know Mr. Keeps annoying, but you gotta put up with him and buy back that Dodge unit. Okay. Hi. You don't want to go to the pawn shop? Well, I'm not doing any more research on the G3 until you do. Gene said you might have the old Dodge unit that goes with this bounty suit. Oh, yeah. We got that. Why? You want it? I want it, too. So it'll cost you. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, we, we know how buying stuff works.
All right, there you go. One Dodge unit. Have a nice life. All right, we got it. Let's try this bad boy out and then head back to Gene. Take your time browsing our wares, but don't take too long. Oh, hey, get your hands off. That's not for sale. Good eye. That thing's a real beauty, and I'm keeping... Oh, you're still here? Can you even read? Oh, are you still looking? Oh, hey, get your hand. Good eye. That thing's a real beauty. Oh, sorry, partner. That's not for sale. Thanks. God, I hate giving this stuff up. Oh, sorry, partner. That's not for sale. I hate to part with that.